in some breaking news that is coming in. Uh, the Chief Justice of India says that they don't accept the MCD, the, the MCD and uh, the LG's submission. This is regarding the elections of uh, the mayor in the Delhi Municipal Corp, uh, uh, body. Elder men do not have the right to vote, including the first meeting. This comes as very strong political uh, repercussions and it's a big victory for the Ahmadmi party and being seen as a setback for the BJP. It needs to be emphasized, mayor once elected will conduct the meetings. The first meeting of the MCD for the post of mayor, the members who are nominated shall not have the right to vote. Over two months, the elections have been held. But we must uh, remind our viewers that the elections for the councillors had happened way back in December, around the 4th of December. And uh, since then, uh, the mayor, the, the, the entire controversy around uh, the, uh, the election of the mayor has uh, has uh, uh, has not been cleared up. Now the Supreme Court giving its verdict. Uh, Sunil Prabhu joins us for more on this. So Sunil, uh, a victory for Amadmi Party. The elder men don't have the right to vote. Is that what the court has said? That's right. Uh, the uh, 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 Supreme Court, uh, headed by the CGI bench, has uh, finally said that we don't accept the municipal corporation of uh, Delhi as well as the left-hand government's uh, submission. Older men do not have the right to vote including in the first meeting, and they have gone further to say, even for the elections of the deputy mayor, as well as the standing committee. Uh, it's uh, been very clearly uh, uh, said that they have no right to vote, uh, and they have issued directions uh, to the lieutenant governor, as well as the uh, municipal corporation of Delhi, as well as the uh, uh, De Delhi government, uh, to issue notice within 24 hours on this very important aspect, uh, and see uh, that... Uh, uh, the date for a meeting is fixed uh, as soon as possible uh, so as to be able uh, to conduct this election. Uh, and uh, this uh, really paves the way uh, for New Delhi uh, because we've had elections uh, for 250 councillors on the 4th of December. And we have only seen, uh, you know, uh, a big uh, fight uh, taking place and uh, uproarious scenes on the, uh, the municipal corporation. Now the stage has been set by the Supreme Court uh, for an election. Right. Thank you, Sunil Prabhu, for those details. We've been joined by Priyanka Kakkar of the Aam Admi Party. Um, uh, thank you for joining us. Um, Ms. Kakkar, so this really becoming a political victory for the Aam Admi Party. Is that how the party looks at it? Good evening, Sneha. Uh, Sneha, we have, been, we have been saying this from the very start, that the constitutional provisions that the DMC Act was very clear. Now, uh, unfortunately, you know, what happens is that uh, but the court has held. The court has held that after at the first meeting, uh, the, the nominated members that were appointed by the LG will have no right to vote. The court has also held that the mayor will preside over the elections of the deputy mayor and subsequent elections. Also, what has happened? We have to see what BJP does. You know, now every minute judges' time not only causes the public exchequer but takes away time from other litigants as well. Iski bharpai kon karega? जो बात स्पष्ट लॉ में लिखी हुई है, वो भी भाजपा मानने को तैयार नहीं है। They should understand, we are not Congress कि कर्नाटक में आपने सरकार तोड़ फोड़ ली। We are आम आदमी पार्टी, we are not going to let any illegality happen under our watch. Right. Uh, Priyanka, in fact, if you look at what has happened, the elections for the councillors happened on 4th December last year, if I'm not correct. And uh, we are talking about mid-February. And uh, the entire MCD still being almost in a limbo, even though Ahmadbi Party does have a significant majority. Sneha, so we've been we've been working from the day we uh, we were chosen by the citizens of Delhi. We've been working from day one. Chahe wo kura uthane ka kam ho, chahe beautification of Delhi ho. We have we have been working. Now, it is very clear, at least now to everybody, that the three meetings for the mayoral chunao, you know, we are the winners. We had no reason to create any ruckus. But they wanted to create such a narrative. Uh, but, but, well, I'm glad the Supreme Court has upheld the rule of law. They will have to now follow it. Um, uh, uh, Ms. Priyanka, please stay on with us. We also are being joined by PKD Nambiar, who is a political analyst and uh, also supports the BJP. Um, uh, 
How do you see this, Mr. Nambiar? A setback for the BJP. Ahmadmi went to the Supreme Court, and now the court saying Alderman and the nominated members don't really have uh, the right to vote. I, I believe that uh, this, this decision by the Supreme Court is welcome. The reason being so that this, at least, so finally we will have. Uh, we, we hope to have a mayor for Delhi because I live in Delhi, and I think we really definitely need to have a mayor who will head the MCD. So as far as that is concerned, I think this will uh, pave the way to have a mayor. Now, the second part of it, that just look at the way this episode has turned out. And of course, uh, uh, multiple chaos in the MCD, uh, uh, the, the meetings, and the mayor elections were getting uh, hurt once, once, twice, thrice. But the bottom line is that despite uh, the Amadni party was having such a huge majority, and BJP do not have it, this, whether it is this policy decision or this kind of an exercise, they could have even uh, pursued it later. And uh, at least uh, about a month back or one and a half month back, we could have got a uh, MCD mayor. But I think, yes, this will also have a ramification for the future elections, not only in MCD, in uh, many other parts of, uh, whether it is in legislative assemblies and other places where uh, the only uh, the people who are nominated will not have the uh, we will not be able to cast the vote. I think from that point of view, it's a very clean, clear, cut kind of uh, uh, instruction or a judgment from the Supreme Court. And I think I, I, we all should welcome it. There is a clarity now, but there was not having any clarity earlier. But now, this, since we have a clarity, hope to have a mayor and a clean Delhi, which uh, Amati Party has promised to all of us.